Hey everyone, uh, welcome to the back to the channel, Mark Loeffler Experience. I just wanted to do a quick intro to this video as it's two videos into one. As I went through two properties today, I took you on a bit of a tour of 20 Duke, my brand new building in Hamilton, Ontario, 30 units. Also, uh, we swung by another one of my properties that was just recently renovated. Um, so guys, enjoy. Um, we'll go through 20 Duke first, then we'll go through Caroline. And yeah, I mean, I didn't mention the numbers on Caroline. I think so we went from $700 in rent to $1675. So it's an increase of $975. Quick math, guys, it's almost $12,000. It's a little bit less of, um, of increase. $12,000 out of five cap, $240,000 in value that I'm adding by renovating this unit and getting the rents up. Like guys, it, it's, it's insane. Like, so my return on investment. So I spent, I probably, I spent a little bit more on that unit because we took down walls and we did a couple different things there, but I'm probably only spending 20 grand all said and done, maybe 22. And I mean, that's a 10, 10 times return. 10x return, even with COVID, it took a little longer to renovate that one. I mean, I'll take that all day long. All right, guys, thanks so much. Like, destroy the like button for the YouTube algorithm. Comment down below if you like the reno, if you don't like the reno, you like the video, you wanna see more of this, let me know. Guys, we're at about 630 subscribers. I'd love to hit 700 by the end of the week. If you know anybody that might learn something from this video, please share it with share it with them post it to your social media help me grow this guys i really do appreciate this we got about 17 more days before russian dancing or no so if we end end of the week by uh we can get 700 we'll be on our way all right guys we'll see you guys in the next one hey everyone welcome back to the mark loffler experience um well i'm taking you through my 30 unit building today uh we just closed last thursday uh, again, close this from the cottage. I don't know if you guys watched the uh, Mark on the Boat video and you saw how I was leveraging that. So yeah, we closed uh, last Thursday. We have seven units to renovate. Um, funny enough, I don't have the keys. They're with property management and the guys are gonna demo it. Uh, so again, it's Monday, uh, July 13th. So first step is we always get pest control in, especially, you know, we don't know the building that well. Let's see what we can go ahead and kill, uh, get pest control in, demo, uh, rebuild. I'll take you guys through the process. Uh, one of the things I, I kind of want to show you, I'm in the basement right now. I'm here with my good friend and electrician, Adriano Grande. Wave, Ad Adriano. Hey guys, how are you? We're social distancing. This is a selfie stick, so there you go. Um, by the way, I mean, if you watched, if you're on my Facebook, you would have seen me do a video where I didn't even know how to turn the directional, so I'm, I'm learning. There you go, Sharon. So this is the this is um, the the laundry right now. You can see like I'll, I'll get I'll jump in here for you guys. So this is how you got to do laundry, and this is this so far the the door opens doesn't open all the way. So I think that's one thing we're gonna change, guys. Um, Adriano is gonna come in, put LED lights everywhere, um, make it look pretty, clean it up, get more rent and uh, just generally have happier tenants, guys. All right, so we are gonna go, we're gonna go outside now and um, we'll show you the front and the back of the building. And uh, yeah, and then uh, we might go look at, a, at another 19 unit for, uh, for Mark to buy or if Adriano doesn't want it, I don't know. See, who, comment down below if you think and Adriano's man enough to buy it. <laughs> <laughs> You know, you can say stuff, right? Like, it's okay. Actually, I don't know if, if it's going to pick up on the mic, but... Oh, I want to pick it up. Well, there it goes. It did yeah. pick it up. Yeah, I'm going to outbid Mark on the next building. Yes. <laughs> All right, so... Yeah, I mean, lots of work to do here. New doors on all the exterior. We got... Uh, we'll, go, we'll go ahead and pave that. Take down all this ivy. I mean, it looks pretty, but it doesn't... Uh, thing doesn't... Um, it hurts the building. We got one of our great tenants here. I know that might be a little creepy. I walked out like, what is that? <laughs> uh, you know, we get rid of the cars that uh, obviously don't move. We'll put notices out and um, yeah, we'll, we'll basically clean this up. 
But we got, you know, obviously nice neighbors. That's a condo there. This is a totally rebuilt building behind us. Uh, that was fire, had fire damage. 30 units after renovation. We'll probably be looking at total rents of what about 37,000 ish, uh, maybe 38 and current rents on it are about 17, 16, 17. So we have about $20,000 in lift on this building. Uh, so guys, this is a good little project. Again, we have seven units vacant uh, to start with. So we'll get that, uh, we'll get that flowing. And um, I mean, with those seven units, we'll get the rents up an additional, you know, $3,500 a month. Uh, and $3,500 a month times 12, 39,000 out of five cap times 20 is about $800,000 in value that we're gonna add by renovating those seven units. And, you know, other than that, you know, we're gonna, uh, we're gonna have a good time here, guys. Just show you a little bit more of the building here. Here we go. Adriano is happy, can, you can tell because he's gonna, he's gonna charge me lots of money so he can go buy, ahead and buy his own building. You know, again, trees growing next to the foundation wall, probably not the best thing. So we'll get that, we'll get that all fixed up. And this is the front of the building. You can see pretty, uh, so obviously this is a neighborhood. This is, uh, this is James Street South in Hamilton. This is our neighbor commercial building. Yeah. Anyway, guys, that's a, that's a quick tour. I'm sure you guys will be seeing a lot of this building and um, yeah, looking forward to taking you through the journey. Anything to say before we, uh, we cut out here? You guys keep investing and make lots of money, okay? Yeah, it's it's not about it's not about timing the market, it's about time in the market, right? Exactly. Yeah. Take care. Hey everybody, you get uh two for the price of one today. Uh I'm in um my one of my buildings, little nine unit building that we had come vacant. Um so what we did here was we went ahead and um opened this up. There used to be a wall right here. As you can see now that's gorgeous open. Uh, right up, you know, good old Tim Hortons. Uh, I still got a couple of finishing things to do here, but uh, pot lights everywhere. Thank you, Adriano. Uh, dishwasher in all our units. Um, you can see we obviously use good, good marble, uh, stainless steel appliances, laundry in each unit. We put brand new windows in. Uh, we have an island like an island bar, because it is only a one bedroom. So, you know, probably get a couple in here. Uh, coffered ceilings. Probably should replace that old uh, thing. I will mention that. Uh, nice little one bedroom. Lots of closet space. Brand new bathroom. Pretty simple. Tub. bathroom put up the mirror not 100 percent done but there you go um yeah so i mean guys it's pretty simple this is our basic standard we got ikea kitchen stainless steel appliances uh we use marble uh countertops uh redo all the electrical in all the units typically actually that's not even a new panel we didn't have to do it there here so somebody had already upgraded that for us which is nice when you don't have to spend money. Uh, you know, again, decor switches everywhere, uh, decor plugs, and we just keep it real simple, guys. Uh, brand new front door. I'll take you for a little tour on the outside. But yeah, I mean, guys, like this isn't, um, this isn't rocket science at all, right? Like we started this one, it was, uh, $700. And now we are going to be asking, uh, 1675 for rent uh, plus hydro uh, as you can see brand new windows but uh, 
nice new black door on there. Um, yeah, and we got to come do some uh, some um, lawn maintenance there, Dan. So, because I know you follow this, and my neighbor needs to uh, get rid of some of these berries here. Apparently, they're edible. I know this because my neighbor has one, and and the kids were eating it the other day, and they, none of them died. All right, guys. So, yeah, guys, comment down below, like and subscribe. We'll see you guys in the next one.